Hi everyone and welcome back to the Bartol base as we continue on the run and uh, as we continue flying into space that's probably going to be the, the focus for today I do notice we've got a couple of bits to just attend to firstly I see we have a blueprint uh, we're not looking for um, for more dupes right now that is going to stress us a bit uh, so we, yeah, we're kind of on the limit for food. We're good, but we're on a little bit on the limit. The other thing I realized was having a quick look around is this thing is not being supplied. So we do not have any water going down to our uh, oil well, which is bad. Uh, and the second thing, indeed, hello YouTube as our research completes. The other thing was this over here. Um, this one was not connected, which is bad. And this one's extra. So that's, uh, Let's fix that up. Not that that's causing us a huge issue right now. Uh, what else? Uh, no research. Okay, yes, because we just finished the monument. So we'll have a quick look at that in a second. Is there anything else we want? This is the question. Um, I'm really not planning on doing any of this stuff. Uh, launching. I mean, launching would be good. So I think we'll take the launch. I don't know how many data pads we got. These other things I really don't think we need. So... Maybe we'll just back off those for a sec. And the other thing is, because I was recording some tutorial bites today, I have unlocked some blueprints. I didn't open them. I thought I'd wait for you guys so you can see what kind of shoes I get. Gloves. There we go. <laughs> Wild, well, berry at my gloves. Those are the ones. Oh, we got a second one as well. Uh, what do we got? A basic black shirt. There you are. Steve's job's in it. Okay, that's two for now. So we'll get the third one probably this episode. Um, there you go. It's rarely something interesting, but, you know, every now and then we do get something. Um, but yeah, in the meantime, we are filling the uh, infinite oxygen storage on our uh, number one lander. So we will hopefully soon be able to take that for a spin. The question is, where are we going to go? Uh, I think we should just go for the closest one, right? Why not? We'll go for the marshy plantoid and grab some, uh, some artifacts from there. That is the plan. Uh, in the meantime, we should have two rockets potentially going. So our uh, triads rocket is quickly heading out here. Uh, and that's going to grab that in the mass field. And then the second one, Kevin is probably just chilling, I think. So maybe he's on a... He's probably going to bed right now. But maybe we'll just... lock these up a little bit I think they're, they're getting one percent and then jumping straight on it which is not good okay there's Kevin so yeah we'll just get Kevin down hopefully this shouldn't take very long and we'll send him back out give him the uh, center of attention as well why not yeah they do get my swim percent in bed so low morale he's still got low morale shouldn't do we need to up the morale come on Kevin uh, but yes, Kevin's rocket, which is this one. I uh, don't know why he got disabled. I don't know what happened there. Uh, is, this is going to be telescoping, so I think we'll just come out here. Uh, yeah, why not? So I'm gonna, probably going to end up sending Triad to this one, so why don't we just go for a further one with Kevin, because we need to uh, research out there anyway. Although hopefully Triad is also doing some telescoping, maybe. We'll see. You went to the aquatic plants when you play through and grabbed most of the graphene. Nice. Yeah, I mean, Super Corner is so good. It, it's actually been a... It feels to me like it's been a little while since we've... Um, we've actually got Super Cool. And I know I've done anything with space uh, materials. I think... It kind of feels to me like I've been... Kind of focusing on more early and mid-game stuff in general. I mean, not entirely, but more so than some of the longer playthroughs so um we'll see we'll see on the next playthrough with a with an eye on that we might go for something slightly different we will see um because i do like the late game the late game is my kind of preferred um preferred time of the game game uh, what am i calling it game phase i suppose the uh the only thing is it's quite long it ends up with quite a lot of vods and long series and I'm not sure they, they do as well on YouTube, but I have more fun doing it. So we've got a bit of a trade-off, really. I have to think carefully about that. Um, and it'd be great to do an edited series, but I just... I, 
The amount of time it takes to do an edited series is just so long. Uh, yes. Uh, on that front though, actually I did want to mention to you guys, to you guys on Twitch, there uh, should be a load of tutorial bites out this week, fingers crossed. Have some time to work on them and we have all the story traits coming and they're, they're quite short and I should have some time so fingers crossed by the end of the week um, we'll have one or two of them out and maybe even one or two more ready to go. That'll be all of them. Um, for you guys on YouTube, uh, check, check the channel. Click the channel, check, click on videos and you see what's the latest one now. Okay, right, Kevin is ready to go, so I think we'll just ping him away. Uh, and yes, we are we are very close on this one, so... Let's see, um... How far do we think this is going to be? Oh, well, this is going to be short. If this takes, like, a cycle each way, and then... Yeah, like, honestly, I mean... So what did I say? Um, for two dupes, we need 30 kilos a tile then that'll be 120 kilos that's one cycle for two dupes so uh 30 kilos per tile is uh one cycle so 600 is 20 cycles so can we get three tiles and back and grab some stuff in three cycles in in 20 cycles uh the answer is certainly yes uh okay the question is who are we going to send it looks like that guy may be the only pilot so uh that guy um Okay, and he's not a particularly great pilot, to be honest, without insulting uh, for that guy. Triad, definitely a better pilot. Um, I guess we'll just have to send him. The other thing we're going to need is an artist. So we've got MK person. Is the only one wearing the hat? I thought someone else had the art skill. Three people have the art skill, only MK is wearing the hat. Who else has it? Uh, Tim could take it, but... Uh, Z control. Hmm. Okay. Let's send Z control. Why not? Uh, so we'll make that that guy and Z control. Uh, this is an alphabetical, is it? Maybe. And then we will grab some food. Let's go on here. We will. Oh, does the okay great. Uh, copy settings. And we will. Uh, we might want to double this. Hopefully we've got it. Oof, do we have enough pickled meal? We've got loads of pickled meal. Okay, but this is going to take a bit to chunk out the food supply. Oh, here goes our blast shot. Uh, meteor blasters, I should say. Oof, oof, oof. There you are, working flawlessly. Do you have any spare? Okay, we have no spares. I did, of course, turn the meteors on to absolutely... Uh, I can't remember what the, the name of the setting was called, but the top meteor setting, highest difficulty. <laughs> um, but I've got to be honest, th these meteor blasters are dealing with it like a champ. They are slightly running out of ammo, though, which is uh, mildly concerning. But it uh, looks like we're going to make it through. Oh, this one is pretty close. Yeah. Oh, this one's run out. Oh, dear. Okay. Whoops. We really do need more blast shot. The, oh, there's, there's a, the thing is, what I could also do is just blast the ones that are a problem. Like these, what are these ones? Snow meteors. Snow meteors aren't really a problem, I don't know. But, ah, we will well run out. Whereas these big, uh, these big meteors are causing damage. Indeed, it is fire. <laughs> oh god. Ah, uh, yeah, we did just yeah. We did not have enough blast shot. What is what is the blast shot situation? Uh, I think the blast shot situation is we need more blast shot. Uh, uh, does that leave space? No. See, we can do this. Oh, but then that doesn't leave room for. Okay. Uh, If I put... Hmm, I think I've got room to do this. If I put that there and that there, I think that's in range, maybe. Let's try something like this. don't know if we have power for this, but anyway. So we'll split that like that and we'll pull this in like this. There you are. We're into help triple production. Exactly. We need, we need more ammo. More artillery shells, please. Uh... 
Okay, all right, try is coming back. So I sent him on a, on a return, which is fine. Um, we should have an artifact in here, right? Where did it say? Oh, it doesn't. Okay, but it should sound here. Artifact collected. Perfect. The f the colony must grow, indeed. Uh, uh, Ice base lasers as well. More we'll come in. Yeah, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to send Triad, I'll bring Triad back and I'll send Triad out to this one. I'm keen on getting the space artifacts as well, that's uh, important. Okay. Uh, nice, right, we've got food in here. We can, I think we can send it. This is going to be, it's going to be a test because uh, we've not run this one before. Begin. Let's try, let's try. We, uh, you, you know, the thing about running a new rocket is uh, you can always run into issues that you did not foresee. So, well, let's see. Uh, come on. There goes that guy. Off we go. There we are in space. They can take the pets now. Perfect. Have some dinner. Get going. Right, off we go. This is going to take not very long. And yeah, welcome back. 25 months indeed. Thank you so much for supporting me for over two years now. You crazy person. I have a welcome in. I hope you're doing well. I hope everyone's having a good Saturday. Uh, if you're doing anything exciting, let me know. Let me know. But how have you been, Kemp? Uh, okay, yeah, right. So Kevin's telescope of here. We'll head over there. We now have, we have rockets are going everywhere. Um, what is entombed? Just other stuff down there. Okay. Nice, nice, nice. Ah. No power, no liquid intake. Ah, yes. Of course, we need a liquid intake. I forgot that as well. I kind of put that here. Ah. Huh? Oh. Ah, uh, yeah, that'll be why. Did I? There we go, right. Okay, Sadar, Sadar is on it, as always. Making a lot of power up here. I think the steel, okay, the steel's ticking up, which is good. Uh, yes, but we will have to pay close attention to our lander one. Poor Kevin is starving. God's sake. This is not, this just think he's bugging out where he uh, gets there. Chilling after the company supper party. Ooh. I'm just doing so much, oh my god. That sounds like a good time. Oh yeah, I'm fun. Right, yeah, for some reason this got grounded, even though... Oh. I, I did wonder what a supper party was, but supper's a word, and you eat a supper, so I kind of thought that might be alright. Yeah, summer party makes more sense, but okay. A summer supper party. <laughs> Uh, what did he get up to? Did you have a uh, barbecue? You could have barbecue at a summer party. Ooh, take this sparkly, uh, sparkly uh, suit, citrus spandex suit. Who wants that? Uh, Kem, why don't you have a uh, sparkly citrus suit? There you are. You look lovely. <laughs> uh, I'm not sure about that one. It's probably not not my favourite uh, outfit, but there you go. You get some lovely decor from it. Uh, Okay, yeah, let's head to the ice asteroid field. What is there? Uh, didn't it, shouldn't it say? Yeah, okay. Um, solid gold oxide, ice and oxygen. Well, well, that's pretty damn useless. Who wants 70% solid carbon dioxide? Uh, anyway. Ooh, I wonder if I go, if I go through this one, is it going to grab the, uh, let's go this way. I'll go, let's go around this one. Did that do anything? No. Nope. Save ruined us. Okay. Hmm. <laughs> okay. Yeah, we've got to keep an eye on Lander 1. Lander 1 is going to be priority. And then, uh, assuming the success of Lander 1, we will then build Lam Lander 2. We'll just do a copy-paste job. Um, I could have put... Could I put... I could have put one more plastic here if I'd wanted to. Um, to just take that bit of radiation down but the radiation here is very good so we're we'll find everything seems to be working food we've got food power um no one's dying 
So the controls enjoying the phone. Well, it's all good. Okay, no, no issues yet. We might see if we have any issues when we land. Oh, we have high velocity transport. Right. Um, I think we should probably also build some um, interplanetary launchers because that may be useful. Uh, do we need the broadcasters? Not really. We don't really need any of this stuff. Decontamination showers are useless. Not doing space mining, diamond processing, hydrogen engines. We don't need petroleum engines. We've got red bolts. Uh, not doing brack wax or milking or that stuff. Right. Let's call that research complete uh, effectively. Um, we have done everything we need to do. Uh, we can do more, but we don't need everything. Uh, just sublimate it for funds. Yeah, possibly. Possibly. I mean, that sounds very silly, but I mean, yeah, maybe. Uh, there's all kinds of things we can do, but yeah, we'd have to go super late game. That's the thing. Oh yeah, Kim, you've also got the funky suit, the Atmo suit. I gave you this weird one. I don't know. I don't know what it is, but now you've got a citrus spandex suit underneath this very weird lime green suit as well. You are you're full on uh, full on summer lemon and lime there, I think. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, get those built. We'll just hopefully. Yeah, we're gonna have to manually supply the copper, I think, for a second. Uh, yeah, I want it. Some more stuff's coming through. It should go 50-50. This has gone dormant. Okay, for... Uh, eight, only 18 cycles, so not too bad. Impress rising bar to <laughs> behind. Yeah, well, we did almost die at the start, so we had a bit of a rough time. But, yeah, since then, since we got Atmo suits, everything, everything's chill. So, there you go. I haven't been too bad. Right, let's uh, deploy these. Uh, we will... Let's see, before I do that, just double check, because we have a 35 rocket, plus two. So I like doing... Uh, I guess we're going to go on the right side. It looks like this is here, I think. So, um, but yeah, and then the other thing I always do is I do these one at a time, because I have had issues or bugs where you do one, and then uh, the other one doesn't land. So that's... Ooh, I didn't, actually. Um... I didn't bring any hard diggers, I don't think. I'm not sure these... Now, usually, it's a good, really good idea to bring a hard digger. Um, well, well, for hopefully somewhat obvious reasons. But uh, I think we'll get away with it here. Uh, we will need some rock, though. Fortunately, everything is quite soft. Uh, yeah, Atmos is all very, very good, so... Okay, and then this is how we do it. Just so for anyone that hasn't seen the colonizing planetoids at all, deconstruct two of these. We'll uh, pull that off. And then we can put a, a rocket platform in, which is what we need to land the rocket. So deconstruct your trailblazer modules. 35, 36, 37. I just leave 37 because. Um, uh, <laughs> You, so we need 35 for the rocket because the rocket should... Or is the rocket 20? Maybe the rocket's 20 because that's where we're not using a, a petroleum one. That is a, that's another big advantage, actually, I think. Um, kind of forgot about that because usually I use um, petroleum rockets and petroleum rockets are higher because they have more fuel tanks. Whereas uh, the Radbolt engine does not have any fuel tanks. So it makes a much shorter rocket. Okay, here we go. Let's open that up. Perfect. Uh, we will come under here and just dig our way through so we don't have to go through the tree because that would be bad. Uh, I guess we'll just tunnel our way to this. Basically, we're after the uh, pedestals. Uh, and the question is, can we bring them back with us? If we can, I think we can, then we won't have to build anything here. Uh, now the rocket send you back home. Yes, exactly. And we could do that later. But we say we're, we're just after artifacts here, so I'm not after anything else. And then there are, of course, tungsten volcanoes here. Uh, if you want to see a lot with this planetoid, I spent quite a long time here on the uh, most dupes record run, getting a lot of tungsten for a lot of thermium. So, as uh, I control, you will want to move out the way. Things are going to get a little bit toasty over here. Uh, we'll just let that die off. And then we should be able to get in with that. Already cooked a load of stuff. 
Uh, that's it. Uh, yes, but the problem is war cannon. If you get like into a place where, so if I did this on the superconductive planetoid, um, you, you've only got obsidian. So in order to build these ladders to get back into your rocket, you need someone that can dig obsidian, uh, which you know I uh, do not have. So this is not going to work for that. So we need a slightly different crew. Okay, to be able to just grab both of those, and you didn't used to be able to do this. Uh, there was a thing where you couldn't actually move them so you then had to uh, build the uh, artifact analysis station here I think and you couldn't bring them back but now we can just bring them back and then problem solved and that's literally all we came for but I yeah I think with the bar tour what I'm seeing anyway is that we the, all the other plans always seem to be basically entirely normal so um, there doesn't seem to be too much otherwise to do turn that off turn this more slime into dirt they're so hot. But yeah, that's all we're going to do with this run. Um, yeah, I, I, I was just reflecting. I do tend to be very focused on um, on my objectives. So depending on what my objectives are, I'll kind of head straight for them. I'm running out of power. Not good. So yeah, I kind of got to... Uh, I need to set my objectives right if we want the right outcome, basically. Uh, oh, he's still doing telescoping, but that's fine. I think, uh, I don't know where this... Where are these last planetoids? Unless they're not out there, I don't... Hmm. They better not have been removed. Thank you for the follow, uh, Freyan answer, BGD. Yeah, I, I hope they haven't replaced the outer planetoids with these inner ones or something. Something weird. Um... I guess uh, to, let, let's come out here. We should we have enough. I want to get this one. Ideally, this one as well. But I'd have to. Hmm. We can fly around a bit. All right. Let's go this way and then this this way home. Yeah, it should be fine. Let's do that. Hey. Okay. So yeah, the um the dupes we had was Z control and that guy. Okay, so I don't actually need to send Z control because we can do the analysis when we're back on on the home planetoid. So that's it. Uh, yeah. Oh yeah, I did want to address one comment because uh, someone on YouTube did say I had a lot of black areas left on my map and I hadn't fully explored the planetoid, but I don't think that's true. Um, I do have I have pull, pull, pulled back pulling back the veil, which is eighty percent of the map explored. Uh, and I think, you know, around the edges, so the, the edge of the map, by the way, is here. This, so where it goes from unknown to off, this is the bottom of the map. So we've pretty much got to the bottom and this is all hot, super hot magma and vacuum and nothing really useful. And then we've kind of gone everywhere else. So I don't, uh, yeah, I think we've kind of done everything, everything we should have done. Uh, we found everything we, we should find. Uh, we can have a look over this area, I mean, I suppose why not we'll just have a quick dig through over here what is that is that space yeah space here yeah okay looks like the the, the dry sorry but the backing of the world runs out here there's something weird there okay all right so now on kevin to uh do a whole load of telescoping for us when it's locked down to it Okay, Triad. Triad's rocket is landed. That's just a visual bug. I hate that one. Okay. And Triad is uh, de stressing. We've got to empty the artifact module. Self contained. What is that? Self contained system. With the bot or place rare hidden at the bottom. Or maybe there might be. I mean, yeah, I haven't got right to the bottom. I, what, what would there? That's a thing. I can't think of anything that I need that oh, we haven't already. Uh, you no, know, we haven't already found. Basically, uh, you know, like what what would I need to that would really help the colony right now? Unless there's space materials, which I I can't imagine there would be, because that would kind of defeat a lot of the game. We can come down here, see what we can find. 
We'll, we'll do a little bit more exploring, but uh, I, yeah, like I might say, I really don't. I don't think there's anything left for us to find that is see over here. It's just more. This is more of the same biome. Bartor still has biomes, so you know. I think the things within the biome are consistent. Uh, we'll just come across here. And just for, for the sake of absolute completion, so everyone is happy. Uh, yes, I can't bioscan that, which is rather annoying. Uh, come across here for a bit as well, there you go. Uh, We'll have that come across here. Yeah, I mean, Bartle's got some weird stuff, but nothing, nothing too bad for us now. Okay, here comes. Uh, oh, are we melting? No. Should also automatically request some more rad bolts, which is good. And we will uh, change the crew, so we'll take their control off. And we'll put Ben in because Ben. To digger. Hopefully they'll then also grab the artifacts automatically. And let's spit them out over here. See so our self-contained system is there. <laughs> then we'll just restock up on uh, trailblazers. We may only need one of these. I may have gone overkill. Uh, restock the fridge. Keep filling in some oxygen. We barely lost any. There we go. Uh, hi freelancer. Oh. Welcome in. Thank you for saying hello. It's always good to see new chatters. Have you come across from YouTube? Everyone always says it's the second thing people say. As we, uh, as of time of recording, I'm nearing 20,000 subscribers on YouTube, which is flipping crazy. You guys are insane. Uh, I, I, I was happy with like 150. That was that was great. Two, 20,000. Is is so far beyond what I uh, ever could have imagined. If you told me that when I started, I would have thought you were being crazy. Uh, but there you go. It's, it's this whole YouTube channel has turned into a way more massive thing than I expected, and uh, very happy to have done so. Uh, it's been super cool. We got rock crush. Do I have a rock crusher out here, or is it just in the base? Uh, or the office desks. Hmm. Okay, I've got a rock crusher over here, but it's right next to the plants, which is, you know, not not ideal. So I think we have to make some more uh, lime. Just chuck that in there, shall we? Why not? Mm -hmm. Okay. Ah, that's a satellite. What's this one? Oh, boy. Maybe this is another planetoid then. I don't know. I don't know. I was really betting on these ones. Okay, are we... Okay, how are we doing on the artifacts? Artifacts. Okay, tech, Rubik's Cube. I think that's both of them off Lander 1, right? Yeah, I think they're gone. So Lander 1, off we go again. So we've done the... Um, done the marshy planetoid. Let's head on over. Can I... Put an artifact module on this as well, or am I already too high? I'm already max height. Bummer. Oh well. No biggie. Oh, I was going to go through that. We've collected this one anyway. Okay, doesn't make any difference. Off we go. Let's send send that one. With a slightly different crew. We have a digger now. Should be pretty trivial. I, I, if anything, I feel like I've probably over... Um, over-engineered this a bit. Or cosmic archaeologist. Uh, come on. Come on, Kevin. Kevin's sick. Oof. You can do it, Kevin. Please be a planetoid. Why do you stop? Probably breathing. Come on, Kevin. Du -du -du. It's on the toilet. It's downtime. Oh, Kevin. Why are you keeping us on this cliffhanger? They did it. Oh, it's a radioactive field? Seriously? Alright, let's put it. 
Kevin's coming back. That is disappointing. I let's see. So we've got one not going bad. One, two, three. We've got four outer ones here, so we're still missing two. What is this? Space debris, okay. This has got to be one. And then I don't know where the other one is, honestly. This star must very weird. Ghost Rider, welcome back in. Thank you for the sub as well. I didn't, didn't play an alert for that. I don't know why. Oh, we just got our last blueprint. Right, last blueprint of uh, the week. Because I already did two at once. Some more gloves. There we go. Great. Oh, gloves, tops and socks. Lovely. Uh, building lacks resources. Yep, that's what we're trying to solve. Right, suppress that, because I, I really don't care. Uh, and then these. Eggshell to lime. Uh, what else? Fossil to lime. This one, six. And. Hookshell malt to lime. Small one. We don't have any big ones. Okay. Or is it alpha? Uh, no. No pants this week. No, we dodged that one. But. Yep. Okay. We'll just make all the lime, of course, because that's what we do with eggshells. Mm. Looks like our. Ah, okay. This one doesn't reach, so yeah, that kind of sucks. Okay, because we got a load of blast shot here. Hopefully, we have enough blast shot. Triple production. Okay, they're all. Uh, we kind of should repair these guys. Yeah. But oh, I see a load of blast shot on here, which is good. Yeah, the clothes the clothes suck. Hi Zari, welcome in. Oh yeah. Yeah. I mean there's some clothes, but there's very few good ones. Uh, like the the paintings and the artwork and the beds and like the items are the cool things for sure. So we'll see, we'll see when uh, I'll I'm interested to see what the DLC brings will definitely be buying that for you guys. Uh if Clay don't give me a key or anything, which they may or may not do, I have no idea. I mean, I hope they do, but if they don't, I'll buy it anyway, so... I will, um... Definitely be getting the DLCs... To, uh, to show you guys. If they're just cosmetic, I'm, I might not buy them for that, I mean... I don't know. Or maybe I should. Like, I... Yeah, I just use the YouTube money. But, if, if there's any, like, non skin stuff, I'll 100% uh, buying a DLC without a question. If it's a DLC that's just got skins in, then that might be a bit more sketchy. But, uh, you got the race car bed. Oh, very nice. Very nice. Uh, I did that. And, yeah. Well, the, the, the um, I do quite like the, uh, the filament system. I mean, it's, it's the same as the spools from Don't Starve Together, but uh, that's a good one. Definitely helps. Okay, how are we? Right, triad. Triad's back, so I think what we'll do is we'll send him towards this one. Return trip, yep. Off we go, triad. No, I... They, they definitely said that the, the DLCs, there would be DLCs with, like, new content, like critters and biomes and stuff. So there's, it's definitely not just going to be that. But I do, I wonder if they will then, at some other point, um, then add one or two, or I don't know, more packs with that are just cosmetics, because they could do that. Uh, I don't think that's going to be the first thing they release, but it could be something that they release, so we'll see, we'll see. I mean, there's no harm in it. Uh, I hope my, our blast shot doesn't um, melt into the rocky sauce. Hmm. I, I'm a bit torn on critter skins because I think it would really hurt the. Uh, I think glance value is probably the worst. Don't know if that is, it's probably the right term. Uh, I think yeah, it would make it more difficult to to see. But, but I suppose then you wouldn't. You don't have to uh, equip them. Uh, Chem is a. Uh, it's looking a little bit worse for wear here. I don't know what happened. So yeah, if there were skins for critters, I'd kind of be tempted almost to not use them because. I feel like I might make things more difficult. I'm assuming we've been hit by red bolts, so... Uh, yeah, we'll just fix these ladders, because, you know, I'm, why not? I kind of want to clear this down. Uh, I'm going to suppress that. This is a suppress notifications mod, by the way. Uh, 
which is nice. We can just uh, get rid of the warning. That's really not that important. I'd rather have like important stuff here. Um, yes, yeah, so we don't have any research. We don't need any research. Okay, Kevin is stressing. Did I launch Triad or not? I thought I launched Triad. What's going on? What's going on? Triad? Yeah. I swear I launched him. Anyway. Hmm. And for that rocket exterior skins. Ooh, yeah, that would be cool. Like uh, module. You could have different module ones. Yeah. I mean, I don't think there's any reason why they couldn't skin basically every item in the game, right? I mean, you would probably. Okay, the automation and like pipes and stuff, you probably wouldn't want. But I mean, even if you could do like layers like that. But bumps, sensors, rab bolts. I mean, it, like, it, literally anything that has an artwork, which is pretty much everything, you know. Could be could be changed. I, I think it's more of a case that they just haven't got around to it rather than they're not doing it. Um so yeah, we'll see. Okay, off to the Moo Planetoid, we're gonna grab that with triad, and then we'll have to send Kevin off down here. So we got rockets to go. Um still no frozen planetoid, which is bad. Or temporal tear actually. We haven't found the temporal tear itself. Uh, which is another thing we do need to find. So, yeah, uh, still quite a bit of spacey stuff to do. Uh, the other thing we can have a look at is monument. Why don't we do that? Um, I did. I, the reason I wanted to unlock it is so I can work out what we need. Uh, Seven and a half thousand steel and some obsidian. We have the obsidian. We have the steel, but we do with a lot more. Five thousand steel, and we have a lot of plastic and ceramic, which is fine. We have all of those, and the head is missing glass two and a half thousand, diamonds two and a half thousand. So glass we have two and a half thousand, diamond we do not. So we are going to have to go get some diamond, which is actually mildly annoying because this bit is hot. Um, I did uh, insulate it off for a reason. Oof, five tons of refined carbon, I don't know what we've done down there. That's got very hot. Um, so we're going to have to go grab the diamond, unless we make diamond and diamond presses. That is a second way of doing it. All right, see, we've got down here, and it is just magma. Uh, ooh, um, hmm. This looks like safer diamond, but this is not a lot of diamond. We might actually have to make diamond uh, for that. Let's see, we got swamp charge here, oh, why not? Um... We need two and a half thousand tons and we lose half when we dig it. This stuff is only a hundred... hundred kilos a, a go. So digging this in half, this is 50 kilos each. Ish. Uh, the head is two and a half thousand. So two and a half thousand divided by 50 is 50. So I need to dig 50 tiles of these. Although to be, to be fair... 14, 16... This vein plus another reasonably sized vein, um, we might be able to get away with it. But what we probably want to do is dig it, build with it, and then shut this off very quickly. Though it's already it's already pretty hot down here, so not too fast. Uh, this vein looks big and solid, which is good. So I think if we cracked in here, cracked in here, uh, built it quickly, and then uh, ran away, that would. Um, we sort our problem out or meet our goal I should say what is this this electrum electrum yeah nice yeah I, I mean given how quickly we can do these missions I don't think we actually need a second lander rocket to be honest I may have overbuilt that um the, this one rocket can get around the six planets with pretty quickly given how speedily we can get there and back so don't need to worry about that Right, we've got a little bit of weight on these rockets, so we've got some chill time now. Uh, yeah. So the and then the, yeah, the key thing is we need more steel, which means we need more lime. I think we've got a load of say a load of iron. We have some iron. Um, guess we can just bump this. We'll just grab 
Uh, how much fossil have we got? 37 tons. So that's a good amount, but it's not a load of it. Um, the fossil is coming from... Where is it? It's a mineral, isn't it? It's the red mineral. Oh, we got the... Uh, yeah. We got a load over here, so... There's no reason why we can't just dig this up. I mean, not that we need more right now. Fossil, at least fossil is flipping easy to find. Uh, on the map. On the materials overlay. Just grab a load of it. I mean, why not? Uh, yeah, there's lots in this, this biome. It's clearly a fossil biome. Oh, why not? Uh, and then, yeah, we'll just keep chugging away at the steel. I mean, it's it's slowly ticking. Uh, we could copy a, and do another one, potentially. This is also providing us a little bit of power. Uh, it should be power positive, the steel production, which is good. Okay. Uh, what else do we need to do? I mean, I think that's pretty much it, right? Uh, we just need more space stuff. It's kind of the focus of the run. To get that done, our plastic numbers are ticking up. Everything's holding together right now, so um, yeah, I mean, we could go on to more stable. Oh, it's not no power. Uh, yeah, our power's not necessarily very sustainable, and our food isn't great either. Is there a reason why they can't get here, or. Oh, they can, okay, they just haven't. With it. Hmm. Yeah, maybe it just wasn't priority. But... Can we fix these two. We're in a fixing mood today. Fixing. Oh, yeah, there's no point. Well, let's try and get this built. Hmm, they must have just been doing other stuff. I guess they're, they're, they're probably focusing on blast shot maker and steel and stuff, which is slightly higher priority. So, yeah, it makes sense. They're all doing this stuff over here. But that's fine. We'll just, yeah, as long as the dart, I think, is slowly chipping away at stuff. Kind of the main thing. Oof, is there a way we can... Maybe we can, yeah, not breach this. That's right, let's build this. Should be able to do that. And then we can push the uh, salt water that way. Get this salt water guys attained. Would be nice. All right, 60 seconds into uh, Calfano, and then uh, same again. Some more POIs around here. None of these can be um, a planetoid. Temple Rotair could be somewhere out here as well. That's there's a thing. So, okay, the rocket's in orbit. Then let's go. So I'm just gonna go for the lowest place because it's usually the safest bet uh yeah it should only be 20. see so yeah, i forgot about that too used to petroleum rockets 20 this is the this is actually a quite a significant advantage of rad bolt uh engine rockets so yeah something to keep in mind do a bit of digging. Here's our lovely gassy moose rocket platform. There we go. Of course, we are using some steel for this, so. We'll come across there. We will shoop and burrow our way through to the artifacts. That is very important. Okay, maybe, maybe Ben digs and, and that guy builds. Because, you know, he's our digger. There we go. 
พวกพวกพวกพวกพวกพวกพวกพวกพวกพวกพวกพวกพวกพวกพวกพวกพวกพวกพวกพวกพวกพวกพวกพวกพวกพวกพวกพวกพวกพวกพวกพวกพวกพวกพวกพวกพวกพวกพวกพวกพวกพวกพวกพวกพวกพวกพวกพวกพวกพวกพวกพวกพวกพวกพวกพวกพ That's a two down. So I don't know if this is anticlimactic, but um, yeah, point of this run, we just want to do the main challenges. So that's why we're well, not going to do too much with these. But um, I think next time they do love studying under rockets. I don't know why. But yeah, I'm, I'm definitely getting a, a temptation on my next run to do something where I utilize other planetoids a bit more, because uh, I do. Uh, yeah, I definitely have a tendency to. Just kind of grab what I need and then leave them alone. I, I do not build multiple colonies. Um, I usually, obviously, I build my main base out big and then maybe a second planetoid. But usually that's kind of it. So we'll see. Maybe we'll challenge ourselves next time to do more planetary stuff. But yeah, I mean, that's pretty much... We just came for that. So we got one sink and... Second one. There we go. A strange brick. Looks awfully much, a lot like a phone. Um, okay, so he's having a narcoleptic nap or something. Okay, off we go. That was all we did. So there's the Gassy Moon Planetoid. Uh, achieved circuit overloaded. Hmm. What are you overloading on? Oof. Rub bolt. Rub bolt generators have overloaded it. Okay. Guess the, that plus the... Uh, um, plus the... Meteor blasters. Too much. But we do have a load of blast shot now, so that's good. Spare ammo in the tank. Okay. Triad's coming back, um, Kevin, Kevin is back which is good and he just needs to chill. Uh, so next time we'll send him out this way. Yeah, these uh, these meteors have really made a bit of a mess on here. Um, yeah, we've gone through all of this. Nothing much, we found all the magma down here, we'll have to dig into the I mean, we should see the bottom of the map in that case, which is, yeah, we'll see. Uh, but yeah, we've, we've pretty much explored this map. I don't think there's anything anything too surprising left. Um, but yeah, I don't, yeah, kind of got everything we need, because I didn't set too lofty a goals on this. Maybe I should have been more ambitious, I don't know. But I felt like doing the main three achievements was fairly ambitious. Uh, maybe it wasn't, I don't know. I don't know what you guys think. Was I was I under ambitious with this, or do you guys agree? We'll see. Hmm. Okay, let's go chill, Kevin. Down. So we really need to find the uh, um uh, the frozen plantoid. It's very important. Still got low morale, Kevin. Not actually going down until he goes into some more morale buildings. Yeah, I think so. I think so. I was just trying to come up with any, any goal is kind of arbitrary. It's like when do you when do you finish a game of only never come across here. Uh, we could also if we wanted. We just uh, can we get down here. We can't get down here. thinking we can sneak our way across and in the spirit of doing a little bit more exploring uh, we could shoot across here I'm sure Sadat will jump straight on that there he does there he goes now he's going for dinner all right don't mind scrap that uh, suppress that as well or oh, Kevin hopefully Kevin Kevin's got some better food 
And a nice bed. And his morale will uh, shoot up. Sufficient. There you go. Well, that's something. We shall stop offsetting the, uh, the damn massage table. Right, fertilizer, sure. Don't really want it. Fine. I never use the farm station. I almost never use it. Except for um, doing GMOA okay. Just never use the farm station. I, I just don't think it's useful, sustainable wise. Build more plants. Build more plants. Build fertilizer. A waste of time. Resources. Okay, that's more like it. Minus 45%. Well, oh, I cycle. My morale. Minus 60%. That's more we're talking about. Actually, I should put this. I'm being an idiot, aren't I? Um, silly me. Always put massage uh, things in a massage clinic. Because it, it gives them all sort of decor. I just need one decor item. Why, why didn't I do that? It's been a while. It has been a while since I built one of these. You guys didn't tell me off for being stupid. Yeah, we should definitely put them in a massage room and then uh, get on with that. Okay, that's better. Because this uh, also hugely increases the, the bonus for basically no effort. Just decor right on with an arrow crop. Come on, there's a lot of lines. Heaven will shoot down. Okay, yeah, right. Move plant is coming back. Uh, Right, it's coming back. Let's just double check how we're doing. Because they say there they used to be a lot of bugs with um, cosmic archaeologists. So we have two terrestrial and three space. That does sound correct, which is good. Okay, and morale morale's fine. Apart from the guys that are on rockets, the morale is is perfect. We have enough population. We just need the monument. So as long as we have enough steel for the monument, then we'll be will be super good. Uh, no issue. This doesn't fit. Oh god damn it. I have to relocate this. Okay, but anyway, that's uh, that's all good. Right, so Dart will pick this up, I'm sure. Has he done more digging? Okay, he's done a bit more over here. What have we got? Blank canvas. Why, why don't we dig this nonsense out. It's just gonna... Okay. See what's under here. I mean, why not? Uh, some of the synthesizers there. Some of the synthesizers are very good, by the way. Uh, if you haven't seen the tutorial part on it, I would definitely recommend checking it out. Um, very interesting conclusion, I thought. Not what I expected. Uh, farm station to be reasonably useful when you have limited resource. But... I, nothing's limited, Zara. You know this. It's only as limited as you as you make it. Sorry. Right, I just I just don't think it's, it's necessary. Oh uh, yeah. I'm just to six all that. Also, ask someone to come analyze that. Why not? Okay, how's our massage room? This is already a massage clinic. Hmm. Let's see, and the, and the bonus is what does it say? Okay, I think it about only says when you get off. Uh, what temp are we at? Mirth leaf? Is that gonna? That'll be fine. Put mirth leaf in there. Well, it didn't seem to be necessary, but we'll chuck it in there anyway. Yeah, and Triad at this point is just going around grabbing artifacts. So. Let's see. Hmm. Alright, I think we're all good. So, probably focuses on steel. I think. And the steel. Steel focuses lime, really. Apparently, so. No, it's a small, small industrial brick. Uh, Seems to have done the job, to be honest. Also, think, should we repair these? And move these over. Oh, look at look at that! Boom, 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 boom. 
all it took. Yeah, we'll just we'll shuffle this one over so we can fit two in here. That's a bit of a mistake. You recruit a skilled farmer for plant mutation. Yeah, if you're doing plant mutations. Uh, I, there will be a specific tutorial bite on that, by the way, as well. Get on me. Topic of tutorial bites. Um, I did briefly cover it in the plant tutorial bite, plant mutations, but uh, people wanted so much more info, even though I don't think they're very good. But I will explain that in, in as much detail as, as I possibly can. While still keeping things to the point. Um, so, yeah. Uh, stay tuned for that at some point in the future. So with the story trace coming first, so we're struggling for power, maybe. How's our co Ooh, our coal is going down? And plant mutate. Yeah, I mean if you do that, I I will definitely give it a read. Uh, how do we make more power here without? Um. Hmm. Because I'm still relying on coal, really, and we're on a bit of a timer with that, actually. This bomb, this bomb's going, the steam turbine's in. Should we do, we could do some um, geothermal. Problem is geothermal's so weak, but we could do it. Current load's only two kilowatts. That's the problem is this bomb. We could also stick in some more minor gems, that's kind of, there's another possibility. What are we in for good? Yeah, it's peaking up to seven though, because seven's quite a lot. Um, maybe we go for some geothermal. I haven't, have I actually done geothermal in a game? I'm not sure I have. Um, okay, if we're going to do geothermal, we kind of need to do it properly. Uh, Any hide? Uh, yeah, that's true. Actually, we could just do vents. Um, yeah, yeah, I'm sure there was one somewhere, but I've got no idea where. Natu There's a natural gas one here. Okay, well, why? Yeah, maybe you're right. Let's uh, keep things simple. Um, to start with. We'll take that out. Not the key tile. Uh, hello there, Erebus, Lord of the Dark. Very ominous name. Welcome in. How are you doing? Right, we'll put a gas pump and we'll use our steel because we have steel. Uh, we will put an atmos sensor in. Over here, why not? Still using tungsten? I don't think so. What is this? Atmos sensor lead? Yeah, it's fine. It does take a lot of time, yeah. I'm not very good at building them either, because I actually do not have a lot of practice doing that. Okay, Ghost Rider is on the case. We will, I guess, uh, can we get away with a normal transformer? I think we can. The only slight thing is I don't have any, um, I don't have any cool any more space in the brick. Uh, that's kind of where all my cooling is. So I guess the nat gas gens are just kind of gonna we'll just stick them up here, let the water polluted water uh, go. Why don't why don't we do that? Um, before we could just do something like this. I don't know. Uh, Uh, power, power, power. We'll make him out of steel, although this is going to cost quite a bit of steel. Um, the, the dripping happens on the third tile, I'm fairly sure. I think. <laughs> so, we're going to do him like that. I'm going to straighten this off, because why not? And then we'll dig. We will... Then, I mean, I suppose... I suppose we'll steal that muck root. We may as well, um this up here like this uh, and then the amount of carbon dioxide we're gonna get is pretty flipping negligible but we can um, connect it to this 
uh, and then yeah important to not connect them over the top of each other so don't just drag across the top because the carbon dioxide passing will block it I'm pretty sure so don't do that connect them as I've shown a smart battery yeah put that in here why not there we go I think that's probably good enough Let's see. Oof, pressure damp. Too much, uh, too much liquid in here. We'll do that and that, so we'll just push this, uh, push this water out of here so it doesn't split this tile in half and over pressure. Uh, yeah, I tell you what we're going to do, just to finish this, let's bosh, bosh, bosh do that. Uh, why is... Okay. How are we doing on this stuff? Okay, Kevin should be good to go, right? 6%? Is that Kevin? Or is that Triad? Kevin? Sadat, that's Sadat, oh dear. Sadat has too many skills, right? Uh, Kevin, you're good to go. So, yep. Send it, and we should, uh, remove the artifact. First, of course. Plasma lamps, eggs, uh, and then triad. We're going to go for this one this time. I think available. That's the one. Send it. And then, uh, yeah, lander one is returning Im imminently. Got some prints as well. Uh, uh, we'll take some lime. There you go, some lime. Right, but I've also, by the way, completely got over the end of the episode. Not paying attention. So... A uh, quick summary for you guys on YouTube. What we've we done, well, mostly space stuff. We've been flying around all over the place and grabbing some artifacts from there. Uh, a bit of expansion on this plantoid. Um, well, we're going for this nat gas, guys. I've kind of set up some uh, salt water collection over here. Not too much otherwise. So, um, yeah, mostly space stuff. And we'll be continuing next time. So, for you guys on YouTube, thank you very much for watching this episode. And hopefully, I'll see you in the next one.